Hi, so what are the problems of today's spectrum usage and where are the in innovations in research? Okay, I would not call it problems, I would call it <coughs> opportunities we have there. So on the spectrum side, I think the first point is that we make the spectrum available in time so that we have uh, rather speedy processes uh, and then we have simple mechanisms to utilize the spectrum and that the community, that means the regulators, the licensees and also the vendors of equipment need to work hand in hand together in order to see what are the boundary conditions to bring the best system to the markets at the lowest cost. We are talking about a new system, 5G system, and uh, it will be a revolution and not uh, only an evolution from the 4G systems. That's what we have been discussing. So if you had the chance to redesign everything from scratch, um, the, spectral, uh, spec the usage of spectrum uh, resources and licensing and all these aspects, what would you do? <laughs> Yeah, if I would be God, I would clean up the spectrum again and do a kind of harmonization worldwide in order to remove the patchwork, but this is uh, a bit uh, unrealistic to assume. So if we do a clean slate design for 5G, I would really try to keep it simple and stupid. So uh, because the more complexity we add in, uh, the more costly it will be and the more difficult it will be to make a positive business case out of it. So keep it simple and keep it straightforward. Could even mean that we would need to divide and conquer, meaning for different use cases designing a different system because I don't believe that the one fits all approach uh, will fly. It will take too much time to specify it and it will uh, be too costly uh, and uh, possibly no one will use it at the end of the day. So tailor it to your needs and keep it simple and straightforward in design.